everyone. Welcome to Straight from the Divine Tarot. We are Wednesday, March 20th, 2024. I'm here to do a collective read for you guys. It's the timeless read. I don't use the signs. I don't use the genders because it's all energy anyway. So if this is your reading, you're going to know from the description of the characters as well as the storyline. So take what applies. Toss the rest. Don't try to make things fit if it doesn't. I will be using the he and she pronoun just to keep it straight in my head. No other reason. So if you have to switch the genders and or the roles throughout the read, go right ahead. That's not a problem. Just remember, it is a general reading. Not every read is going to be for you, and, and if it is, chances are not all of it will resonate. Meaning that the parts that don't resonate, leave them alone, leave them, just disregard them if you can, please. I know it's hard, but it doesn't belong to you. It belongs to someone else, okay? So use your higher wisdom and discernment. I'll bring out the tarot cards. I'll give you the description of the cards as well as what I'm picking up intuitively. You know your story best. It can be all the descriptions, some one and or none, as I said. And then we bring it together at the end. Please do me a favor, if you wouldn't mind. Please like and subscribe. Join this beautiful soul tribe. I would be truly honored if you did. For the ones who have, thank you so very much. I love you. Um, thank you for all the love you show me, the support, the super thanks, and the donations, the messages, sharing your stories. I'm truly honored, and I love you. I truly do. Hope that you're having a great day. Um, I just want to start off by saying thank you. I did receive your message. Your message. <laughs> and it's nice to know I have a friend. Um... You know who, if you know, you know. Anyhow, we'll move forward with this. We'll see what the goddesses have to say at this moment, shall we? Goddesses, what is the message for the collective? How would you like to start this message? Oh, boy. So, revenge. That came out a little bit uh, testy, don't you think? Dee Dee, revenge. Hmm. A lot of people involved. There's a lot of hands here. It's the overarching energy. Remember, when you're... I mean, revenge. I mean, vengeance is his. Okay? That's all i got to say. So if you're out to, to get revenge against somebody, and you're digging a, a grave for them, you might as well dig two. One for yourself as well, right? Bottom of the deck, the under, underlying energy is prosperity or zuli. And I have shuffled this deck. And this is coming out... So you might be coming into some prosperity. It has something to do with money. Take it as, as it is. Whatever, yeah. Somebody has to atone for something, Scotty. Some truths have been spoken, but, I mean, the truths are known. They haven't been spoken yet. Hmm. Have to atone for something. Lilith, equality. You have to balance something out, make something fair. Pentacelia. Somebody's guilty as you know what. Uh, maybe they're feeling a bit guilty for something they've done. Or maybe they accused you of something you didn't do. Yeah, they want the guilt to stick on you. It's not going to happen, okay? So somebody's obsessed with something. I don't know how you pronounce this. Changi. You're very fortunate. See the bunnies here? This is also fruitfulness. It's, it's prosperity. It could be some pregnancies. I don't know. Some, the globe here, something to do with online, you could be traveling, you could be famous, moving, we'll see. And Fomnok, somebody's very envious of you. See, again, the sword's pointing down. People know this. There's going to be like five transitions, or it, see there's a potion here and a book. They could have been doing um, magic that's going to be affecting five lives, but four are going one way and one is going the other. So you could have taken the road less traveled. Um, you know, they could have been doing love and lust spells, seduction, anana, anara, trickery. Not good. A lot of abuse going on here. Ran. Pandora. They opened up a box of chaos, okay? They were very deceptive. Curiosity, by the way. Medea, deception. And now they're heading towards their fate, Fortuna, because they're under judgment. Their hearts are being weighed. Okay. You've been empowered here, Sekhmet. You're very protected here. It's They're being delivered here. Oh, yeah. Deliverance. Okay. Or something's going to be delivered. <laughs> Maybe a baby. I don't know. We'll see. We'll read what this is. Dee Dee Revenge. Uh, I keep hearing... What is that? Anger or hate or something like that is like drinking poison. Poisoning yourself for what somebody else did. I don't know. Take it as a plus. 
So somebody, somebody's not thinking straight here. Dar uh, think about what you should do rather than what you want to do. Don't act in haste. Your partner's ex, wow, is on the warpath. Think through all your options before taking drastic action. Tell someone how you really feel about a situation causing you sleepless nights. Negative behavior needs to be addressed. So somebody's been acting like a real dink. So it could be your partner's ex or your ex-partner's ex. Or take it as a plus. I don't know who this is. It could be anybody, actually. You could be this person's, person's ex and they're... For some reason, they're coming after you. You really don't care. If they're, if there's an ex in here, they're an ex for a reason. You don't want them back. Prosperity. Avoid borrowing too much money as strings are always attached. A lie is exposed. Time to choose the right person for you and stop stringing others along. Clean out your space and give your unwanted items to a good cause. Recycle more, waste less. Be honest and love and a debt must be paid. So somebody paid or borrowed money to do stuff against you, possibly spell work. They're in debt. And if it's not boring money to do spell work, somebody was ripping off your ex or something like that for money. You got into this relationship for money or your ex got into a relationship for money and they think it's your fault for some reason. That their lives going up upside down. Nah, you have nothing to do with this relationship for fuck's sakes. That's what I'm picking up, right? You don't care. Go. Go be merry. Go your own way. You're an ex for a reason. But also, the debt that must be repaid might be from um, karma, okay? Because karma's going to come bite in the ass and play with stuff like this. Thank you. Okay, I'll use this deck. DT Revenge. So somebody's going to be... Somebody's in trouble. I, that's a, I'm picking this up. And you have nothing to do with it. Um, it's not going to affect your life one way or another, Okay. They're trying to make it affect your life, but no, it's not, okay? What I'm seeing here is if they're in debt monetarily, they're in debt to seedier, fa seedier factions. I, I'm not saying seedy. I'm, I'm just saying you borrow money from places that you don't normally borrow, or you know what I mean. Um, and uh, the interest is high, if you know what I'm saying. Take it as a prize, okay? There's one story I was picking up oh, a couple of years ago. Somebody was dealing with drugs or something like that. And they ripped off a dealer and blamed it on you or tried to. This could have something to do with this. It's something like that, okay? You know what I'm saying? So, Dee Dee, they're, they're being found out. I think everybody knows what they've been up to and they're trying to cover their tracks and they can't. They want revenge on you. Oh, there's too many. Dee Dee Revenge, please clarify this for the collective, please, Spirit. Fated to suffer. I was thinking of this card this morning. 25, something's moving forward or they've been stopped. Take it as applies, okay? They have to take accountability for what they've done. It can be a dealer of some sort poisoning the minds of young. Yeah, maybe they try to poison the minds of others or they're, you know, temptation, getting, you know, tr contributing to the delinquency of minors. I don't know, something like this. We have Colorless Angel. It's just they're going to their fate here. They're gold diggers or cloud chasers or something. I don't know. This is change, divine timing. Yeah, universally backed here. They're being drained here of everything, their money, everything. This could be the partner that they were with or are with still, and they're being drained. This could be a, a an energy vampire as well. Bottom of the deck, blinded to pain. 13, so something's ending here, okay? Death and rebirth. They've done it to themselves, whatever this is, okay? If you trigger easily, please sign off. Because it, just this alone can tri trigger people. I realize that. But um, I have to give the message, okay? Somebody that can be into self-harm or some, something. Somebody let something fester for too long. Okay? They didn't see what was to happen. They were just in their mostly dark aspect in their shadow. They were so hell-bent on something. And they didn't see what was to happen here. Okay? They didn't foresee this. Um, you, you, you remained, yeah... So that's the other thing. The divine doesn't want you to see their karma. Okay? 
even if they've done you wrong, you're a kind-hearted person, you're a pure heart, you don't want to see people suffer. So they're blinding you to this, okay? This is not your business, what's going to happen to these people. You're going to re you're remaining peaceful amongst the thorns, okay? 26, you have integrity, loyalty, and honesty. Um, you're centered here, you're, you're grounded, you're doing your work, you're doing what you must do, you're keeping balanced. Someone, want, someone wanted power or control over you or control your actions or your feelings. Uh, it could be somebody that's doing shit in your life and wanting to see the, the, the effects of it one way or another. You know, if they check your profile on Facebook or IG and what, they want to see you going through a hard time, but you're not. So they know whatever they've been doing, it's not working. Now, they could have been using magic against you as well. Got tempted into doing that and all it's doing is draining them. They're life force, their energy, their health, their money, their relationships, whatever. And this is self-imposed. Okay. Yeah. Right in a cage, 21, something's over. It could be online. You could be a mother. It could be a pregnancy. It could be a divine feminine, male or female. It just means that you're create you're a very creative sort. You have unconditional love. Uh somebody wanted to keep you in a cage. Because you didn't want anything to do with them possibly. Or they wanted you in a cage so you're far away from your ex maybe. You're not interested. Pluto's involved. So this is. Uh, the underworld. You could have been married to this person or in a committed relationship or something. Or this is them. They're stuck here. They're stuck in the house. Could be um, house arrest of some sort. Fragmentation. Wow. They're fragmented here. Their mind, their money, their stories, whatever. Um, the pieces aren't fitting together nicely. 27. There could be an investigation. They need some healing. That's for sure. They need to be on their own and do some healing. They're hiding and cloaking a lot from you, from whomever. Okay. If you know who this is, just stay away from them. I mean, I think you are. Just continue doing you, being you, being happy. Don't worry about it, okay? Stay peaceful. No matter what they're throwing your way, whether it's magic, whether they're attacking you online, whether they're, um, I don't know. It could be family as well. It could be anybody. They're trying to attack your prosperity. You're happy. And prosperity can, can look different ways. It doesn't have to be about money, but it could certainly be about money. It could be about business. It could be about anything. But you're prosperous in all ways, meaning you're happy. You're, you're not, not going to let the, the, the actions of one person bring you down. You know what I mean? They don't have that kind of energy or that kind of power over you. You're not going to give it to them. Woo. This, is a, not, this person, it doesn't have to be age, is very immature. It came out in reverse. It's a karmic, six in reverse, lovers in reverse. Poor decision making here, okay? False contracts, could have something to do with contracts. Whatever this is, it's consequences. I'm going to leave it there. Maybe they tried saying you were the karmic and they're not. I don't know, take it as applies. Something to do with a wealthy man, 13, change. That's death and rebirth. You could be the phoenix rising. Congratulations. You took back your power. Three, uh, one and three is four. It's the emperor. You took back your power and you bossed up. Could be a boss. Could be a leader. Somebody that's established. They make good decisions for all involved. Um, they're very wise. They're very experienced. Could be in the reverse where there's corruption involved. Abuse of power. Abuse of authority. Somebody had a huge ego wanting to dominate. But this is change. You're bringing change. Maybe you've changed. You know. You've healed, you've done a lot of work on yourself, and this person can't stand it. Oh, they're full of shit. They haven't changed yet. You know what? Just because you haven't changed doesn't mean other people don't change, okay? It happens every day, okay? So, yeah, you put a lot of work. In labor has something. Maybe they're trying to affect your work, but you've put a lot of work in here. You've, you've elevated for sure. This is justice, 38. Justice in the upright. They could be working for criminal fashions. Korea. They could have did something illegal against you. There's a journey here. It could be a soul's journey. I mean, we're all here to elevate. Um, 
and this is the soul's journey in tarot. It's the fool's journey, I should say, from zero to 21. You've gone through it all. You're ready to take off. You're moving. You're traveling. I don't know. They don't, they don't want you working. Maybe you're traveling and working. So they want you sick. They could have said you were mentally unstable. I don't know. It's the emperor again. Bad health. There's going to be a message. Somebody's going to be in bad health. Distance horizons. You might have to travel to see them. Maybe they figured it. Maybe you wanted to travel and they figured, well, you know what? I don't like that. Since they're prosperous after me. <laughs> I don't know. Some people have weird fucking thoughts. Let's just keep them where they are. Oh, I don't know. Go get go get some help. You need it. Go have DD revenge. Oh, I'm so tired of these people. It's fated to suffer. T five. Um, colorless angel 10 and mature woman 6 in the reverse. What's the message here, please? I mean, it could very well be a mature woman in, in age. They're not acting their age. Slander and rumor and gossip. They try to ruin you. Not very fucking um, mature. Okay? Gold digger clout chaser. There we go. Why am I picking up your ex went around saying that they're coming into a, lot, a large amount of money, but it was your money they were talking about? This is an inheritance. Good for you. Somebody's a fake. What I tell you? And that's how they got this person, and now this person's mad at you. <laughs> they spread a lot of rumor and gossip about you and slander. They defamed your character. Well, that you can sue them. Okay. Keep them in the poorhouse indefinitely if you wanted to. You're very healthy. They could have said you were mentally unsound. If this is again the inheritance, and or they could have said you had an STD. It caused a lot of pain in people's lives. Here, somebody thought it was funny. They laughed at your pain. That's an inheritance. Uh huh. They celebrated this. They wanted you to be afraid. Now they're in fear because it's it's ramping up here. What's coming up is their their karma. They want forgiveness now. This could be a con man or a con woman, and or they don't like your confidence. They know you distrust them. They want people to d d distrust you because they have low self-esteem. Someone's examining something or they need their head examined. Someone's in disgrace here, okay? There's a lot of apathy going on. They have no feelings. You're, uh, you're leveling up. Or they're showing you apathy even though you're doing well in life. No one wants to con congratulate you because you're doing it the right way. They don't do stuff the right way. Yeah, something to do with income. Something to do with a parent. Truth is coming out. Somebody has a serious illness or they wanted you to have a ser serious illness for life insurance as well as an inheritance. You're very responsible. They're not. Or they're, they're going to be held responsible for this. They targeted you. Identity theft. Somebody came in love bombing you, but they had hidden motives. They slandered, libeled you. And now this is sabotage. They're trying to sabotage you. Or they sabotage the relationship you were in or family or anything to break you up. Somebody's out of control. Or they these people broke up. Now the one is out of control. Now they have a grudge against you. Some about money, mental illness. They got money to say you were mentally unstable. They're getting fired. Somebody in the courthouse here. They were doing magic. If they're losing their faculties or mentals, it's because they're doing magic. So there's victory and success for you. The secrets are revealed. These people are insecure. Okay? Fake, fake, fake. So they, everything about them is fake. Everything they said about you was fake. If it's a family member, they fake their love for you. I hate to say it. I, I, it sounds really crass and doesn't sound very nice. I know. But they're fake. Fake-ass people. Okay. I'll use the other deck then. So we have Deity Revenge. Colorless Angel 10. Fated to Suffer 25. Mature Woman in Reverse and Slander Rumors and Gossip. What's the message, please, girl? Well, they stole an inheritance all right or they wanted to this is family discord they're losing everything long-term stability long-term relationships everything and this is what they wanted for you be careful what you wish on to others now i do know some of this karma that's coming to these people okay they brought it on themselves 
He got involved with people that are not nice, okay, when you cross them. Um, and they do take care of their, their problems. They don't go to the police, if you know what I'm saying. So these people are in trouble. Now, whether it's spell work or whether it's different factions of society that, you know what I mean? You hear about them, but you don't say them. They're in trouble. Okay. They're in trouble. They mess with the wrong people coming after you. Or they tried to sick these people on you. These people aren't stupid. These people know the truth. And they're coming after these people now. Ish. All I can say is if you are in fear of anybody harming you, please get the appropriate help. Okay? Can't tell you what to do. And even if I did tell these people what to do, chances are they wouldn't listen to me because it's coming out of my mouth. Right? This message, please. So do what you want. Okay? Remember, it is your choice. Send you a great deal of healing. You need it. Thank you. It's all from grace. Putting on an act here. Overdoing it with the addictions, possibly. It doesn't have to be that. This is not wish fulfillment at all. They're not coming into their wish fulfillment. They're just nothing but gluttonous. Uh, regaling people with other people's stories because they their life is un... You know, it's not exciting. Too afraid to take a leap of faith, too afraid to experience life properly. So they use other people's stories. A party say, a liar, liar, pants on fire, king of swords could be a narcissist or worse, male or female. Pathological liar, user, abuser, cold, calculating, and cruel, very abusive. Lied about a queen of cuss energy, male or female. It was very loving, very um, this unconditional love, very uh, emotionally balanced, stable, and mature. Very nice, kind, sweet, nurturing, generous. Highly intuitive and psychic as well. Could be a mother figure, doesn't have to be. Yeah, so their lies aren't working. They said maybe this person wasn't working. Something's getting around fast though, okay? Uh, they're trying to stop your work. That's what it is. 8-8, eight, eight, if this resonates. Because they want you to appear unstable. These people are greedy and selfish, okay? They're, un they're insecure. You're, you, you rising up in the world or you being okay is making them feel insecure. They committed some sort of crime here. They're heading, they're trying to hide this. They're heading towards some sort of bankruptcy or they wanted you to be. Maybe they did some ID fraud, some credit fraud, ran up your credit and wanting you. Yeah, they were hiding this, okay? They didn't think you were aware of what they were doing. You're quite aware, okay? Whatever they're doing, it's not going to work, though, okay? It's going to be a backfire. This is bad news. I'm trying to block your work. Ain't going to happen. They're only blocking their own. What they wish upon you is going to come back on them. It's bad news. There's no communication, no forward, move, forward mo movement. They targeted you, like I said, okay? Where are we going with this? Yeah, they're going through a dark night of the soul here. You're not, you're not talking to these people, maybe. maybe. If it's family, if it's an inheritance, you're not talking to them. It's making them feel even more shittier because they got caught. They have to come clean. They know they're caught. They walk right into their own trap. They're, they're going to be arrested, or maybe they have been already. I don't know. You let go. You, you let God. You surrendered this to God. They're not like martyrs right now. Now they want to cooperate. Now they want to compromise with you. People are seeing things from your perspective now. You let these people go. You had every right to. Yeah, they're worried. They're stressed. They're burdened here. They're fighting off whatever they conjured up if they screwed with magic. They're having nightmares. This is what they wanted for you? I don't think so. They're scared. Like I said, they're scared. Strength in reverse. Because they committed a crime against you. Okay? Or they're going to have to fight for, them, fight for their life here against criminal elements in their society. Hidden elements right there was a lot of lies and illusions possibly magic so maybe this magic's coming back on them and or these practitioners they roped into doing this magic against you now they're taking on losses now they're realizing this person was a lying sack of shit it's all coming back okay 
You lost control of the situation. They've been humbled here. Their ass got spanked. I just heard. Wow. No. Wow. They could have been planning this. This is over. Okay. Even if they weren't planning this, this is over. That white rose indicates baptism by fire. They're getting cleansed. Somebody's cleansing the neighborhood, <laughs> the family. I don't know. Getting rid of the bad apples. I don't know. Okay, they wanted this for you. This is life insurance planning this for you. Yeah, to steal your inheritance and life insurance. This is family discord. Couldn't give two shits about you, right? Somebody's heartbroken. They broke your heart? Yeah, well. Normally these swords are in the heart. You took that the, the swords out of your heart yourself and you healed your heart. You're healing right now. Well, these people need to heal. But they got a lot of burdens on their back. They put a lot of burdens on your back. If they put burdens on your back, you're very quiet about it. You didn't cry. You didn't scream. You didn't rail. You didn't ball up your fists and ask, scream to God, why, 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 why me? There's a lot of lies and secrets here. So, yeah. You're not talking to them. For some reason, this is really bothering them. You're not even paying attention to them. Somebody's heartbroken. They're going to lose this money. It was all for naught, I heard. Okay. They got caught up in their own net and their own knots here. They stepped into their own traps, trying to trap you. It's all backfiring on them. And now they're heartbroken? Wow. Not because they did this to you? Yeah, they did. They, they got, they bribed a lot of people. There's a lot of temptation going on here. They could have multiple parties. They could have said, you slept around on them. This could be a, an ex-partner, like this in a slender room or whatever. Somebody's sleeping around here. Multiple options, a lot of confusion. And a snake wrapped around somebody here, offering them all these bits and bobs, you know, all these baubles, the shiny things that don't last or matter. I mean, the def what, whatever that you gain from the devil, you're not going to keep. I'm trying to cover up, right? It's illusions, hopeful, wishful thinking. This is a dark high priest and or they... Broke the law. It's, it's, a, it's a broke breach of contract. Or they're not going to win in a court of law. Take it as applies. Divorce or separation. Somebody had multiple partners. Maybe that's what they said about you. Could go different ways. Yeah, somebody's watching here. Watching from a distance. They've made plans online. At least two people. They're getting caught. Somebody's moving forward with something. I just heard surveillance. Damn. They're going to get hurt here. Or they want forgiveness. They're going to get hurt. This is the five of wands in reverse. They wanted you to fight with these with them and or to compete with them. Um, playing gaslighting, gaslighting, mind games. Um, this is power plays. You took the high road. You didn't engage and you walked away with your head held high. Picking your battles wisely. Now they're fighting, fear pointing, blaming one another. But in this deck, they're not. Ex they're not exactly fighting, are they? Uh, I think it, it's dawned on them who was responsible, what was going on. They're not going to fight against you. That's for sure. They know you're not com competing with them. They know who they, who's behind this, and they're t discussing it. They're watching it online. They, they know they're under surveillance. Okay. They're spying. <sighs> Someone was jealous. Someone was abusive, hateful, spiteful, prostitution, and or doing black magic. They found somebody online to do this. Somebody they were married to. There was a celebration. This is property. Somebody's a player energy while they were married. I don't know. This is weird taking action they did something too quickly and their plans fell through they didn't want you moving forward in life i don't know why even though they're married to somebody else or they're with somebody else why you and what you're doing in your life why does it affect them well because they're a narcissist or worth worse a sociopath or a psychopath how dare you have a life after me right yeah here it is they made accusations against you that just weren't true. They can't, they're unfounded. They want you feeling overwhelmed and defeated, or this is how they're feeling here. They didn't protect you, defend you, or your honor. 
They have no defense for what they've done. They could be open to spiritual attack right now. They can't block anybody coming in and giving you an offer of love and or support and or fealty. Help. Yeah. Somebody working with you. Or somebody's working with them. Somebody's cheating and got an STD. They said they slept with you and got an STD. Or they wanted your family got them involved. Okay, this is a story. This is the, the joker they got involved to come after you to get to infect you with an STD so they can take you out. Or they set this joker to come and block you. Yeah, to make you sick. Wow. This is a scandal. Somebody's scared. They they're sick. Maybe maybe they're they obviously have an STD. Maybe it's it's finally caught up to them, right? They said that you were juggling them. Oh, this is the other person. Okay, so if your family hired this person to come and love you up and infect you, their wife or their husband or partner, whether they're married or not, was involved. They knew about it. They wanted the money. Hurry up and get the money. You know what I mean? But it didn't work out that way. You didn't get infected. You're responsible. Now, the wife or partner got them into debt. They were doing death magic. They were doing all kinds of magic against you so they're in debt they stole your your inheritance they have to pay it back or go to jail they're scared nothing's working out their plans fell through i mean these bozos here okay and now they're blaming you for it everything they try to do against you they're blaming you it's all your fault no nah. Yeah, somebody's bossed up and took back their power. Somebody has to do something here. Okay, this is somebody at the helm or somebody in law. I don't know. Yeah, they were holding back some money here. They were hold, they're trying to protect themselves as an institution or a family. They're trying to protect themselves. They were greedy and selfish, don't want to let go of your money over my dead body, I hear. I hear. Well, that's fine. Archangel Azrael's here. Okay. One way or the other, you're going to pay this money back. Ah, oh, they're greedy, self-serving, wow. They're planning to take you out for your money because you're stable and secure. They scapegoated you. This is a family or a group going down. There's going to be some communication coming towards you. You stood, you stood ten toes down, still inspirational. This is something exciting. Typically, it's good news. Not happy that somebody had to leave home or leaving this family or something. They're not happy. You're getting the message, though. You get the fuck away from these assholes before um, the worst of the worst comes in. Yeah. You're going to get a message from a king of wands? This person might say they have power, but they, they're very... The power they, they hold, it could be an executor. It could be just anybody working in a law office or in a court system or something. Thought they couldn't get burnt, but they don't hold this rod. This rod's not in their hand. So they don't have the authority. They don't have... Jurisdiction. I don't know what this is, but this is a leader of some sort. Or this could be you, male or female. Somebody's going to be contacting you. Or there's, this could be you. You're a leader. Maybe you didn't have the authority to act on it, or somebody didn't have the authority to act on it just just yet. This could be a spiritual leader that's actually doing spell work on you, that's talking shit about you. The secrets are coming out. Okay? They were plotting and planning and trying to hide it. They're watching, looking at your future. Oh, no, no, no. We can take this money. Is the ships coming in? They're secretly watching you, waiting for your ships to come in. They were plan plotting and planning to do something else. Because all their plans fell through. But your ships are coming in. You're moving forward. You're expanding your horizons. You could be moving at a distance. It could be also somebody's going to reach, reach out to you. Somebody's coming back on them. Unfinished business. They've been stop, stopped here. They can't move for any further. They don't want you traveling. They don't want you to be seen in public or something. Or they don't want to be seen in public. You could be a reader or a spiritualist and you're speaking your truth. And they want you offline. They're trying to block you offline to affect your money here. Because they're going through some sort of um, spiritual jail, prison, financial uh, loss. They're trying to get themselves out of poverty. Trying to stop you. I don't know. There's proof and evidence here. Of some sort. They were really malicious and cruel. Showed you no empathy at all. They were all self-serving. Somebody could be drinking a lot because you have proof and evidence or you are proof and evidence. Take it as applies. You could be out in the public eye um, one way or another. Even if you're not, you can just have a, a profile. 
You know, it could be Facebook, it could be IG, it could be anything, TikTok. But people can see that you're happy, you're healthy, you're not these things these people accused you of. You know, you're not talking to these people. So they want to just stop this. No, no, no. They wanted to ruin you. How are we ending this for you, please? There's an investigation. There's been no communication. Maybe you haven't heard anybody from anybody or anything yet. It's because they're investigating this. The snakes are being found out. There's going to be a raid. Something's going to be happening quickly here. They could have been plotting and or planning some sort of drive-by and or vehicle or, you know what I mean, while you're walking down the street here. Somebody's very angry here. Parted ways. They're spreading egregious gossip. They could. This could be covens and or cults or friend groups here. They lied to these cults and covens and friend groups, and they're finding this out. They're losing money left, right, and center. This was not a good proposition here. Chariot in reverse. They could be uh, losing money. They could have lost their car. They can't pay for their car payment. They can't travel. I don't know what this is. Ace of Pentacles. This is missed opportunities. They're unstable. They stole money. They're in debt. Yeah. They want to affect your money because you're speaking some truth, setting boundaries. This was unfair here, what they're doing. They wanted you to look unstable. Transition here. Somebody's getting cut out. They try to cut, cut you out of this inheritance. But at first, okay, thank you. They wanted to affect your money. Sold down your money one way or the other so you'd be more amenable to signing this false contract they had for you. To get you involved in some sort of, yeah, this is the Empress. Get you involved in some sort of scam which could very well have taken your, your, your freedom away. Got you involved, you know, got you arrested and or got you in debt and or gave you nothing. You got nothing with this inheritance. Gave them power of attorney over you. Yeah, they wanted... They wanted a life of luxury, but this is not you. This could be an imposter. They could have forced your signature. Somebody that's taken their selfies. I mean, the queen, of, I don't care what, male or female, the queen of pentacles is stable and secure. Okay? They're very grounded. They're not going to be taking one selfie after another and posting it everywhere. Or maybe that's what Spirit's telling you to do. Post pictures of yourself. Tell the world you're doing great. You're grounded. You're stable and secure. Maybe that's what they're saying. Take it for what it is, okay? And typically, that that energy doesn't do that. They're, they're very grounded. They're not, yeah. They showed you no love, okay? They're thirsty people. This could be a pregnancy as well. I don't know. Yeah, they're immature and insincere. If it's a pregnancy, somebody in the equation got somebody pregnant, it's not their child. Or maybe they're telling your child that, telling the father of your child that you did this. I don't know. Somebody wanted you left out in the cold, feeling abandoned. That was their greatest wish. They're having an, an, um, an emotional outburst. They're emotionally immature and insincere, unstable. This is not good news that you're out in the public eye here. That you healed. Oh, they could have said Gen STD. But, or mentally unstable. It's not, yeah, they're going to get kicked off. of, Or they're, they're, they're not going to get this inheritance. Because you're, you're healthy. You're a healer. You're balanced. You're divinely protected. You could be in your north node, right? You're out in the public eye. They're seeing you. Whoever this is, this imposter is immature trying to impersonate you. And I think they're, they're not doing it correctly. Their stars haven't aligned. I don't know. This is somebody that you were in a relationship with and they're jealous of you like all get-go. It doesn't have to be a relationship. It could be family, friend, whatever. They're unstable. They want a life of luxury off your ass. <laughs> it's not going to happen. Okay, this was a crime. It's going to be out in the open. Okay, this is victory, success, reward, recognition. Or they wanted recognition. They wanted to look like you and lord it over everybody that they're they're rich and stable and secure. Yeah. No? no? Somebody's gathering some information. They have to pay something. They pay people to make you look like this, not a custom reverse, saying that you're not wish fulfillment. Nine, nine. They bash you over the head, okay? There's a lot of emotional wounding here. You know exactly who's responsible for it. And they're going, no, I didn't do it. They're acting like they didn't have anything to do with it. Meanwhile, look at the blood on the sleeves. Yeah, Five of Swords had a grudge against you. They wanted to embarrass and disgrace you, but I think it's them that's going to be embarrassed and disgraced because you saw through the illusions and de you detached from them. You're not karmic and you're not toxic. You have no codependency issues. It's a bad investment. 
Everything they try to do to to you, it's it's being revisited on them. They're losing money left, right, and center. They are in debt. There's nowhere to go here, but down. Okay, they didn't see this coming. This kind of snuck up on them. Indecision here, stalemate. They're in denial. They're going to jail. They won't see this coming. They're stuck. They can't go any further. They can't overcome whatever it is. They probably maybe wanted you to, to, to be stuck feeling like this in your head. Or maybe they wanted to place you in jail, but they're going to jail. They're trying to stop this. They're taking some sort of action, walking away. No, they have to take accountability. They got a lot of stress and burdens on their back here. They could be at a distance making a decision here. <laughs> There's no love here. They showed you no love. They were very uncompassionate. Is that the word for it? Very thirsty. They showed you no love. They didn't want you having love. Didn't want you having wish fulfillment. But they were reckless, careless, and foolish, okay? They're getting some karma. They went up against an earth angel, somebody that's very balanced and healed. A healer that's here for a reason. And not to to be a, a scapegoat to these people. Not to be a fucking punching bag for these people. Wow. It's ruin. Okay. You averted all the calamities they planned for you. Now, how's that happened if you're not in contact with the divine? Tell me, huh? Revenge, Dee Dee. Well, guess what? It's all turned around on them. There's a lot of people involved. Mainly, it could be a main three, three people, because there's six arms here, but it could be many. Okay, they were greasing palms. Or Zuli, this has something to do with your prosperity, whether it's spiritual, um, financial, or all of it, okay? I mean, you're prosperous when you're happy with whom you are and in your life. And you, you don't harm anybody. You have nothing to worry about, you know? You're, yeah, they're blinded to pain. They thought you didn't know, but you damn well do know. Uh, this is an ending here. You are the phoenix rising as well. This is whatever they did to you is being done to them. Okay? This is self-harm. Harming you is self-harm to them. So, yeah, the colorless angel, they were trying to drain the coffers, I heard. Wow. This is uh, gold diggers and cloud chasers, okay? This is destiny and fate. You need to go through this to propel you where you need to be. Hmm. Change. Divine timing. You remain peaceful amongst thorns. No matter what they were doing to you. You just focused on you and what you had to do. One step, one foot in front of the other. And that's the way to do it, to bring back balance in your life. These people are fated to suffer. Okay, they were poisoning the minds of others. They were possibly poisoning you or trying to or claimed you did. And or they were doing magic, magic, working out of the shadow, right? They could have been involved in, you know, D-R-U-G-S's, you know, um, con contributing to the delin delinquency of others. Take it as a pleasure. They accused you of it. Somebody's not very mature. It doesn't matter what age. Mature woman. Um, they thought you were immature, that you wouldn't uh, have a normal life. Meanwhile, what's a normal life? Okay? They thought you weren't serious about life. Oh, yeah, you were serious. It's that these assholes were coming into your world and disrupting your world. That's why it made it look like that. You know, oh, they're always falling on their face. They're always broke. Well, because these assholes coming in going, I need money. Help me, help me, help me. And they, they, they suck you dry. And you said, finally, no more. You know, face your own karma. Face your own misdeeds. Answer for your own missteps. Because you were taking on their karma. But you're dealing with a very immature woman as well. So wealthy man, 13, that's the end of this person's wealth. Or this is you coming back. You're coming. This is the rising phoenix. You're coming into your wealth now. Okay, you took back your power and your boss and up. Gold, gold digger and clout chaser. Slander, rumors, and gossip. Trust me, you can sue. Okay. You can sue for more than that. From what I, They're fake. There's a lot of bribery going on. Somebody got kinky. I think they got blackmailed too. There's long distance travel. They don't go, want to go to rehab. Oh, well. Fame and celebrity. You can get famous out of this. You could be a celebrity or they were chasing fame and celebrity i don't know fame and celebrity has you know that doesn't turn me on i don't know about you to me i remember being downtown where i live here one time and um i don't know just minding my own business i don't know i was about six or seven college age kids came up to me and go and they, i should proof us preface this by saying they were filming just down the street where I live here is like nor um, 
Can um, Hollywood North. Okay, they do a lot of filming here. All the shows you watch on Netflix, a lot of them are filmed here. But they were filming down the street where I was. And they came swarming up around me going, where are you filming? What are you filming? And I'm like, what the fuck? I got mistaken for an actor. I have no idea who the actor was. I didn't even know who the actor was. But I got scared. And they were like all over me. I had tears in my eyes. I, I had, I, I, I hightailed it out of there. That scared the shit out of me. My heart was literally pounding in my chest. Like, it was like, what the hell is, I wouldn't want to be famous. That scared the shit out of me. I'm a very quiet person. I like to be in the background. I like my autonomy, you know what I mean? That really disturbed me. So if anybody's going after a celebrity, good on you. I don't know how you deal with it. And I'm not a celebrity. I'm not famous, but oh my gosh. That scared me, so I don't know how, how the, you know, the ones out in the in public eye do it. So we have 14. This is bringing back balance and healing for you, possibly. You could be an earth angel or higher. Divinely protected and guided. You transmute and, and you alchemize all their bullshit. Maybe they're looking for healing from you. It could be a healer. These people are drowning. At least four people are going to be drowning here. Not literally. I don't think so. I'm swimming with the fishies, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. Maybe somebody, it's higher power involved. One of four is um, oh, the, the Hierophant. It could be highly spiritually right, but I'm, I'm picking up its courts, its, its contracts, its, yeah. Belief systems, maybe. 22, you're on path, you're on your north node, possibly. Okay. And 36, an investigation. You're shining a light on things, okay. You could be alone, you did that, that healing work. You're under the umbrella of the divine. You're shielded from the worst of the worst here. Okay. Um, I'm picking up that the angels are watching over you. The divine's watching over you. They're shielding you from what these people are going through because you do have such a great heart. Okay. And your, your, your first instinct is to come and help and you can't. You can't interfere with whatever this is. Okay. Because then you're going to take on their karma. I don't want to tell, I don't want to say don't help people, but in this inst instance, if you knew what they were going through, you would step in, you would, it would break your heart. But you have to remember these people did it to themselves. They wanted this for you. It didn't break their heart. Okay. So they were gold diggers and cloud chasers. They're coming after that wheel of fortune of yours. Okay. Is this change? Maybe this is going to help them change to be better people. Okay, that's only hope. You went through what you went through to be who you need to be. We all do, okay? You could be saying, oh, they're lucky, they're fortunate. No, they're blessed. They, they, whoever this is has done the work. Stop, okay? They don't deserve this. Who are you to say what they deserve? You're not in their everyday life. You don't know what they've gone through. Chances are whatever they've gone through, you could never go through. You would never be able to overcome it the way they did. Just because they didn't cry about it, carry on, they took it on the chin, made it look easy, and trust me, it wasn't. How dare you? Concentrate on your own life because it's falling apart. So the sunken cradle, going with the flow. Going with the flow may sound idealistic, but actually that is what is required of you now. You do not need to take immediate action or do anything in particular. Just allow things to float along as they are. So let spirit take care of it. You may have recently gone through emotional changes and it's likely you have experienced many emotions such as sadness, anger, and frustration. Now you're slowly coming out of the other side and beginning to feel more like your old self. Just allow yourself to be who you need to be at this time. This is a card of slow pace. So accept this. There's no action to take. Just be kind to yourself and allow the healing process to work. Your instinct will let you know when you have to act. So for now, just relax and listen to your inner guidance for further instruction. They have it under control, okay? Just because you don't see it, it's, it's meant to be that way, okay? Prisoner of mourning. Disappointment, lethargy, lost love. You have given your emotional energy to another and may now be feeling let down. So this is them, okay? Uh, disappointed and vulnerable. There's confusion around you as to where things went wrong as when you fall in love, you love completely and put your all into a relationship. Be assured the issue is not with you. The timing for this union was not right and someone better will come into your life and the anger and hurt you feel now will seem a million miles away. Okay, this could be for you too. This person was not your person. This person 
the one that got hired to de destabilize you or take you out possibly fell in love with you. That's why they couldn't take you out. Isn't that something? That's ironic, eh? Love will soon come into your life again. And any negative feelings you now hold will disappear. The tide is about to turn for you. You may not know at this stage what you need, but you certainly know what you no longer require. Your vulnerability at this time is understandable, but do not let negative experiences hold you back. Remind yourself that you are a beautiful soul and you deserve better. And we all do, okay? No matter who you are, we deserve to do better, to be better, so our lives don't fall apart like this. So we're not lying to ourselves, okay? Because these people are lying to themselves. They're refusing to do the work, and this is the outcome. 36, winter rebirth. Confidence, ability, multitasking. The ability to look and feel confident when there is chaos around you is quite an art. So because you made it look so easy, it wasn't, but you were graceful about it, okay? Spirit held you up. You were under the umbrella. You were shielded, or they, the Spirit shielded the worst parts, you know, of your suffering from them. Because they got off on it, right? How dare they? However, it shows how much you've grown as a person in the last few years. Challenges have made you stronger and you can hold your head high and be proud of what you've achieved. You are you have an air of confidence about you. Others can also see this and are watching you blossom into the person you wish to be. You're protected and connected to your higher self. A beautiful gift. Learn to use this wisely and watch life expand beautifully. There are messages all around you. Open your eyes to synchronicities. Spirit are talking to you and showing you the way. And they always will and they always they always do, okay? So just bear that in mind. Let's get the angels on this before we, we close this reading. Thank you so very much, angels. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Spirit. What's the final message here for the collective? What's the parting message? Fifty one, fifty one when I looked up. Four cups. They left you out in the cold. They wanted you feeling... Now they're feeling sorry for themselves, I think. They're missing you. They're regretting what they've done. Mella hell. But they wanted you out feeling re rejected. The God deflecting evil. Healing capacity. Protection from weapons. Safety and travel. You're very protected. Congratulations. Ace of Pentacles. Okay, you're very blessed. You have spiritual protection or gifts here. This is a blessing from the divine. Uh, there's offers and or an opportunity coming. Stability. Okay, Ace of Pentacles. Cahithal. Eight, you have integrity, loyalty, and honesty. They didn't, okay? That's all I can say. They wanted power and domination or control over this money or this, this opportunity of yours. The adored God. Your third eye's open. They've been everything they did has been seen. Divine blessings drives away evil spirits and rules agricultural production. Now take it for what it is. Maybe you work in agricultural produ uh, production, you have a farm, or I don't know. Take it for what it is. Somebody watching you that has works in this in, in this field. Two of Pentacles, making a decision, weighing options. You're balanced in alignment here. We all must be in alignment to receive what it is meant for us, including our justice. Okay, you can't sit at home and cry. You must keep going. Stop dwelling on this stuff. Move forward and enhance your life. While you're doing that, justice will come. Do you understand what I'm saying? Okay. If you need to get rid of people or things or a way of life, maybe bad habits, whatever, do so. Get in alignment, please. Poyal, 56 is justice. God who supports the universe. Fortune and fame fulfills any request. So somebody might be famous here coming into fame. Or they were chasing it. Here's Michael. Archangel Michael, the chariot's coming through. This is victory. It's universally driven. Overcoming, okay? <laughs> Bring you back balance. Radical acceptance. Taking accountability. This is victory. What can I say? Perseverance, success, and conflict overcoming adversity. Thanks to Archangel Michael. Thank you, thank you. New beginnings. Wiping the slate clean. You took us a leap of faith. You moved forward regardless of what they were doing. That's what I mean. You, you healed yourself. You worked on yourself. You did what you needed to do in your life. And you let this play out the exalting god you're manifesting that's how you manifest by the way co-creating with the divine you are moving forward you have all the tools you need congratulations well and new beginnings assist with difficult and great undertakings cupid might be coming in by the way <laughs> you're the star fame out in the public eye wish fulfillment healing you could be a healer you're on your north node possibly 
This is the higher powers involved. This is divinely, uh, divinely guided here. Okay, this is a divine protection as well. God, the just. Your 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 prayers have been heard. Every tear's been counted. I just heard. Okay, and your wishes are being granted. Clemency and equilibrium protects against attacks in the courts. So they tried to attack you. They tried to attack your character, your life. They used the courts. They weaponized the courts. It could be people working in the courts as well. That's why it's going to hit the news, okay? That's where, why the celebrity here. Four of Wands, you're stable and secure. It has something to do with property, marriages, stability, homes, family. You're going to be celebrating here. Mahasi, uh, higher powers involved, okay? A decision has been made. God the Savior. Rectification helps one live in peace with everyone. Congratulations. I'm so happy for you. I am clapping for you. Keep moving. Okay? Things that, It might seem slowed down right now or in stagnation. Trust and believe when I say it's not. Okay? You must believe that. Just keep doing you. And you'll see. You'll, you'll go with the flow. You'll see results. Hope you like the read. Until next time, take care.